All right. Well, that's that. Bob Myers, <sighs> president of basketball operations and general manager of the Golden State Warriors. Stepping down, stepping away. From this? He's going to have a press conference at 1 o'clock. We'll carry it live. But the reports are now out there that Bob Myers has basically told the Warriors, it's time. It's time. So the Warriors are now in the business of looking for a head of basketball operations, Guru, because it's not going to be Bob Myers for the first time in over 10 years. I don't like it. I'm going Troy Aikman. I don't like any of it. I don't either. And... Stanley, I feel like he has a jersey, and rightfully so. But, I mean, you talk about just, you know, what he meant to Draymond Green. And I heard Shasky say it, just everything that I was thinking. What's the chef thinking? What's everybody else thinking behind closed doors? But the number one question, Stanley, is who's going to get, who? no pun intended, who's going to get dubbed? Who? Who is going to be the next GM? And I got to tell you something because I missed you three-day weekend. Mm. Stanley, I tweeted out last night, no sources that I felt like he was staying. And that's why I got my warrior coat on, because I felt like, Ste- hey, who is it? It's, it's, it's Steph. Uh, who is it? It's Dre. It's Clay. It's, it's Looney. And I thought that might impact Bob, and that's what he was telling the missus and his daughters. You know what? I'm coming back. And, Stiney, I'm a little melancholy. You got to pick me up. It's going to be hard for me to pick you up. Bob Myers is... I'm a little heavy these days. Bob Myers is a... Uh, look... Most of the fans love him. Most of the fans got to know him over the last decade. And he built a dynasty. And he also was extremely well-liked and respected. Great guy. Um, one of those guys that you don't hear a lot of bad things about, if any. And now the question's going to be, what what happens now? It's a great question. Does Mike Dunleavy become the general manager? Do you have a front-runner? Because I think it's Kirk Lakeup. I do have a front-runner, but it's a... It's a hunch, and it's a. Uh, it would be. Uh, yeah, I like this. I, I have a front runner. You want to say it or give it to us now? It's just a hunch. Steve Kerr becomes the GM of the Warriors. Tell me why he would he would do that for his career when he's well, he get a contract extension for one. He's got one year left as a coach, and he's been a GM before. And a couple things about maybe Joe Lacob doesn't want to elevate either of his sons into that prominent position at this point. Dunleavy, if Mike Dunleavy becomes the general manager, I'm not going to be shocked. But let me ask Warrior fans. Yeah. Does, 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 we got a thousand on YouTube. That, that, I know. Man, it's let me let, let me throw it out. Eight 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 nine five seven nine five seven zero is the number. Uh, how important is it? What does it mean? Bob Myers stepping down. Damn. Bob Myers is going to be away. He's leaving. I don't know if he's going to take a year off. Maybe he'll go to ESPN. Maybe he'll Da-da-da. spend Da-da-da. time with the family. Trying to think. Uh, I got the family. Washington. The Washington Wizards job, I believe, is open. <sighs> uh. I can't imagine him uh, taking that taking that job, but uh, I don't I don't I don't think it's a good. Obviously, it's not good for the Warriors. Myers was a different kind of GM. Wow! Like to me, he was he was less about scouting and personnel and who to draft as the guy who was a figurehead of this organization who kept it together. He kept this organization together. He did. So we'll 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 see how it all plays out. And uh, 1 o'clock, 1 o'clock, Bob Myers, press conference. We'll have it right here. Sid Day has just paid $200. Is that true? For a text. This Sid Day. You got to read it. This is a text from Sid Day. $200. We, we, we won't be seeing that. Proceeds go somewhere else. Bob, it was a nice run. I would remember you for all the good things you did. Uh Goo and Steiny keep on bickering at each other. Love you for. Yeah. Uh, it's actually a, a rupee, which translates two hundred rupees into like two two fifty. Oh, it's oh two dollars and fifty cents. Sorry, I feel like Evan's oh, my yeah, kid. That's not a dollar. That's not a dollar sign in front. That's <laughs> right. I'm like he, oh. ball, he or she is balling. Can I tell you what's <laughs> in my heart about this? And you tell me if I'm wrong or if today's not the day. Because I'm always honest with you. Shout out to the H's. 
I believe Kerr, Lakeup, and Bob, there was some friction. And I'm going to another trifecta of guys that caused the friction. James Wiseman, the handling of him, Jonathan Kaminga, and Moses Moody. To that, you say what? Because Bob, if it were his picks, Donnie, and they should be, obviously, listening to the owner, his input, he went grocery shopping, and Steve Kerr was like, it ain't thought out yet. Nah, them stakes ain't thought out. I can't do so. To me, I'm wondering how much of that is has led us to here. Now I got three kids. You got kids. If it's all about the family, all in the family. Shout out Archie Bunkers, Donnie. Um, then I'm wrong. But I just want to share with you. I I feel like that's a part of this. And to that, you say what? I think it probably was, but I actually don't think it was any more than just. A normal disagreement or something doesn't work out. I, I think if you look at it, I just think from a timing aspect of it, th- this is the perfect time for Bob Myers to, okay. to leave. Even if even if Wiseman, let's say, were LaMelo Ball. Oh. And you know, you knew you were set up for the future a little yeah, bit. Okay. I, I still think this would be a good time for for Myers to walk away. I mean, he was hired over 10 years ago. A Don, as you call Pat uh, Riley. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I hadn't forgot. Take a year off and then take your pick of the litter next year. But if year. it's about the family, you ain't you ain't taking a year off. Yeah. No, if it's about the family, don't you take a year off? Well, I thought it would be, you know, permanent. The, the, yeah, the kids are the the girls are young, so you want to be a yeah, see them play ball if they choose the to next do that year. or plays for the next year. Yeah, maybe. Don't do a Bruce Bochy, Bob. I love you to death. Remember how? Yeah, right, right. You know, he was gonna he was done with the sport, but he really wasn't. He was done with you telling them how the lineup should look. Yeah, I mean, I the spreadsheet. Exactly. Eight 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 nine five seven. Oh man, nine five seven zero is the number. Uh, Bob Myers stepping down as president of basketball operations and general manager of the Golden State Warriors. What's it mean, man? What's it mean? I think. Uh, I feel like- yeah, I think it. I think you could look at it as it's kind of the start of That's the end. What I don't like, but you're right. But it is. It is. It is. Isn't it? Well, he doesn't play. All good things well, come to an end. Right yeah. on the table. Early sponsored oh, okay. by Adco Pest Control. Missed you last week. Dot com. <laughs> All your pest control needs go to Adco Pest Control. I'm at living. Dot com. I'm I'm gonna put right point blank range. How confident are you in the Warriors' future? Not. I'm not confident That's, at all, but I, I, I wouldn't be overly confident. I don't like confident. that answer. I wouldn't be overly, overly confident with Bob just because of... Look, there's, but you had the number two pick. Well, that, that, that's He's gone. gone. Yeah, it's gone. You had it. You had it. Like, that's gone now. How you feeling about Kaminga? How you feeling about Moses? I, I think all that... Hey... I can't wait for Bob to speak, Donnie, and he's a Don. I just hate that he's gone, and he doesn't have a jersey, but you're right. This could be the start of what we don't want to see here in the Golden State. I don't see it, Bob. The question is now, who do you bring in? Somebody this, from inside or outside? I got a wild card for you. Can oh. I give it to you? Give it and to Bonte me. left, and I was going to run it by him. I'm being serious. There's nobody I like watching or hearing break down the game that's already played the game in the Hall of Fame and is on the set with our Bonte Hill, Chris Mullen. Mm. I mean that. He recognizes talent. He knows how to get his message across to the kids because, I mean, he coached at St. John's. When you hear that name, I don't know how you categorize. We've never talked about, because he was in this position before, Stani, could he do it and would he want to do it? But I think he would be good at it. Well, he was a GM before. Uh, he pulled off the the Baron Davis trade, and he was the GM during We Believe. He drafted Monte Ellis. Oh man, uh, he had some swings and misses, like a lot of GMs. I wonder. It's been fifteen years basically since he's been a GM. Uh, I don't know. I really don't. I don't know. I. I you said Steve Kerr. You I don't know. Think it now. I think yeah. I, I mean, wow. I don't think anybody knows what's going to happen, but. The more I think about it, 
Maybe we do the Boston model. We do the Boston model. Yes, your boy kick was Brad, in. Kick Brad Stevens, kick Steve Kerr up to uh, general manager. Hire another coach. Maybe it's Kenny Atkinson. I don't know. But it's not going to be the same without Bob Myers. It's not. So I feel like, and I said this earlier, and if you want to jump into the conversation, you can at 888-957-9570 is the number. on YouTube. Wow. They care about their dubs. Yeah. We, we all care about the dubs. We all care about the dubs. I, I was saying this before the show. I feel like this was like Durant his last year, I felt like. I remember in December of that that yeah. last year Durant was here. I'm like, I remember saying, you know, it, the league thinks Kevin Durant's leaving the Warriors after this year. And that never changed. It just always felt like that, his his third year with the Warriors, that, that Kevin Durant was going to leave all season. And I kind of felt that way this year about Bob Myers. When I found out he's working without a contract, that's strange. Woj broke it that Saturday that, night. That was strange. That's very, very unusual for a guy like Bob Myers, who's had that much success, to come into his last year without a contract extension. Wow, Steiny. I mean, that's just not the way it's typically done. So I I always had a little bit of a, a bad feeling about that. Um, if you looked at it from a practical standpoint, let's say you're a Warrior fan, the Warriors win it last year extremely unexpectedly, and Bob's got one year left in his deal again, and he just won his fourth title. Mm-hmm. Wouldn't that have been the... Here you go. Wouldn't that have yeah. been the time where you say, all right, let's re-up you for another two or three years as the highest-paid GM in the NBA? But I don't think that initial offer probably was the highest offer of all time like it may have ended up being. So we'll see. Uh, Uncle Looney, losing Bob is big. I keep thinking that's the uh, real Only movie. in that he's a great guy. The Dubs will hire from within same vision. Lakeup has always hired great people. No concerns at all by Uncle Looney. Well, everybody's getting older, Uncle Looney. That's all. So there are concerns. I'm not saying they can't win, but man, every good thing comes to an end. I just hope we're not there now, and I don't believe we are with Steph Curry, but we saw what happened against the Lakers. They're small. Uh, there's relationship problems, and I got to read this text to you from all the text right. line, Stiney. I feel like I wrote it, and I promise you this is what I'm thinking. So we're in the green room getting ready for Bob on 95.7 The Game at 1 p.m. We didn't know what, what was going on. It, it, he's staying or he's going, and we didn't know if he was going to touch that today at 1. You read the tweet from Woj, so now it's confirmed. I'm asking you, Matthew Steinman, you covered, you've been in the business 30 years. I ain't hyping you up. You know who you are. But how soon is too soon for Joe Lakeup to comment and give Bob his flowers. Because if I were a reporter, would that be my first bit? Stop, I'm thinking I might be in the wrong part of the business. I'm ready now to go ask what other people are scared to ask. So well, should I Joe think- release a statement if it's all good and he had that lucrative contract offer in front of him? Like this, we were like, I'm waiting for that. I'm looking at my, my Shinola watch. Uh, oops. Uh, I'm looking at my watch. <laughs> um, waiting for, you know, a comment from Bob. Let me tell you how it's going to come down. Talk to me. Talk yeah, to what us. I, what I fully expect is that when the reporters get to the facility at, at 1 o'clock for the press conference, there will be a oh, press so release. There. Okay. There'll be a press release there that says Bob Myers is, whatever the wording is, stepping down, uh, uh, not re-signing, and I'll bet in the press release there'll be a quote from joe lake of saying we're indebted to bob for the last decade and what he's done uh for us i uh, hate to see him go he'll he'll always be remembered and it's just time for a change 